Hi, everybody. All right, so Romania actually just arrested two Mossad agents. Um, the official details say two ex-Mossad agents. However, ladies and gentlemen, they were arrested alongside two other persons of interest who are running a private Israeli investigation firm called Black Cube. So, read into it what you want, but either they were still active within the Israeli government or they were contracting doing what they did, which probably means that they were more than likely uh, currently active anyway. So, this came from the Times of Israel. Uh, their agents, Danzarella and Avi Yams, and along with the other two guys, are co-founders and directors of private investigation firm Black Cube. So, the cover story is they're no longer active, they're retired, or they're ex ex employees. You get the idea, folks. That's going to be their cover story, just like if you found CIA fucking up in your backyard, pardon my language, in any of these other countries, they'll claim that they'll no, they're no longer on the books, they were there for land or something else, and, you know, they'll basically whitewash it, saying, yeah, they worked for us at one point or another, but they're no longer active and they shouldn't have been in that region, you get the idea. We've all seen the movies. So the official story on this is that Romania authorities arrested four Israeli nationals for spying on the country's chief anti-corruption prosecutor earlier this week. A uh, report surfaced of a cyber es espionage network set up by the culprits. Um, I'm not so sure what these guys were doing because it kind of almost sounds like Romania double-crossed these guys. <laughs> But if they were operating in Israel under a, uh, what I call it, a private investigation firm, and they were not legal inside of Romania, then yes. They were probably doing two or three different countries' work for them without all the niceies that you want. So Black Cube denies wrongdoing by its employees and says the reports, the company... Uh, Co-CEO Zorella and Giannis are being investigated or false, obviously. Recently, the company undertook a project in Romania, so that's how they end up in Romania, or Romania, to collect evidence of serious corruption in the Romanian government and its agencies. <laughs> so, that's how that ended up, folks. Uh, while performing this work, Two of the company's employees were arrested after having made significant discoveries, a statement read. So, there you go. That usually happens. You mess around in the background, folks. They eventually find you. So, anyways, ladies and geez. Two Mossad agents in Romania, or Romania, have been arrested. They're claiming ex Mossad, but even if they were running under a, an organization company name, they could easily still be active inside the military or intelligence community. <laughs> Happens all the time in these these whether it's a security or investigative firm, it makes really no difference. We all know what really goes on in those firms and Depending on what they're there to do, they should have had more guys and they should have taken more precautions. It, it's almost sounded like they wanted to get caught at this point. So it is what it is, folks. Um, thank you.